Yes, let's start with the learning the letters, how to write the letters. We'll start with the first letter. Which is the first letter? The first letter is A. Yes, we'll write the letter A first. I hope you can see. So, we'll start from the beginning. So, draw the small circle. Come down, up, then down. This is letter A, America, Amma, Appa, Anna, Akka, any of the words. Arun, Aditi, A. Okay? Next, we'll go for the next letter. Next letter is A. Very good. Start with the same type, with a small circle. Come down, down, down. Stop here. Stop here. Go inside. Yes. Small circle. Come inside. Yes. This is your A. Ane. Ane is elephant. Okay. Arya. Arya is a name. Okay. Akasha. Akasha is a sky. So we learned the two letters. A. A. The third letter. Please uh, remember when, when you are writing, when write within the two lines. Okay. It's very important. So the next letter is E. So how to write E? Remember letter 3. What if the letter 3 is slipping upside down like this? Yes. Come down completely till the line. Now put a small knot. This is letter E. Illy. Illy is a rat. Illy. Illy is a here. Okay. Italy. Next. E. Draw a circle. Draw the circle. And above the circle, we draw the symbol. This is called as a tale. Head. This I call in Kannada as tale. Head. Remember this? We use this often after this. Okay? Tale. Head. Put tale. Then in between one line. Then draw this. This is E. Very good. Ishwara. Isha. E. The next is U. So remember the waves when you write like this. Yes? So O is just like the wave. So with a small circle, we'll start from the top, come down, go up, down and up. This is your letter O. Uguru. Uguru is a nail. Okay? Very good. Next. Next letter is O. So write same as it is O. Then come down again. Come down and draw a zero here. Uta. Mean. Uti. Okay. Remember you should never put a zero here. That is wrong. So don't put zero there. So here it's a plain line. But here remember you should not leave like this. You should put zero compulsory. That is O. Next letter. Ru. In Hindi, it is called as a re, but Kannada, it is called as a ru. Okay? So, remember letter 2. So, we also write letter 2 like this. Correct? Yes. 2, then go up. Then what do I call this? Tale. Yes, put tale. Again, put this symbol. U. So, this is letter ru. Clear? Very good. Next is A. So for A, we'll start from the down. Right, we'll start with a small circle and it's like a letter 3, sleeping letter 3. Very good. Then go to the left side. This is your A. A, L A. L A is a leaf. L E, L E is a bear. Okay? Very good. Next, A. Write as it is. Write as it is. Go back now. From here, go back. Turn back. This is your A. Aerial. Aeroplane. Okay? So, in textbook, this will be given like this. Okay? Don't get confused. This is a written version and that is a printed version. No, this will be given like this. So don't get worried about it. So that is a printed version. This is a written version. Okay. Fine. Next, after A, what do we have? After A, we have I. 
So remember this symbol. We use the same symbol. Go up now straight. Again draw 3. Okay. This should not be a straight line. This will be a little curve. Okay. Remember you are writing a little curve here. That's it. Okay. I. Next. O. So remember you draw the swan. The bird. Okay. Remember this symbol. So we write the same thing. O. O. Okay. Next is O. Write as it is. Put a small zero here. Remember. Okay. And put a line. Kodu. Kodu is a line. Horn. Above the head. O. Here. Next is O. Write as it is. This one. Very good. Now dry, draw inverted C. What is C? This is C. What is inverted C? You will write ulta. Mirror image. So draw this above the head. Very good. Then draw a line. Then come down. Don't stop here in the halfway. That is wrong. Don't come down completely. This is also wrong. Just drop it here. Stop it there. Ow. 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 Next, um. Remember letter A? 1 0. 1 2 sonne. Um. 1 0. 1 2 sonne. Again, write A. 2 zeros. 1 up and 1 down. Yeradu sonne. 2 zeros. Yeradu sonne. So now we have learned the 15 letters. Okay? A, A, I, I, U, U, Ru, A, A. I, O, O, Au, Am, Aha. Clear? Very good. So these letters, still R to Au, we have a name. Okay? So these are called vowels. Vowels. What are vowels? A, E, I, O, U in English are called vowels because without that, we cannot form words. So similarly, without this, we cannot form words and sentences in Kannada. So, R to AU is called vowels. For vowels, I call it swaragalu. About this, there is a notes. I have given the notes at the end of the video, uh, the complete workshop. You can just watch the and copy it down in your book. Okay? That is called swaragalu. And ambandaha, it has one more name. Together, it is called yoga vahagalu. Yoga vahagalu. A in the au swaragalu. Am aha yoga vahagalu. Clear? You understood? Wonderful. We have one more set of a grammar here. What is it? One more set of a grammar is if you observe, I already told you, I have a two pronunciation. A, a, i, i. Right? Yes. So which are the letters? So these are the letters that takes more time to pronounce. Extended time to pronounce. So these letters has a one name. And the, these letters which is told in a less time, it has a one more name. Okay. So what are these letters called? Is Hraswaswara. Which will take a less time is called Hraswaswara. Sva Swara. Hra Sva Swara. Which will take a more time. It is called as Dirgha Swara. Dirgha Swara. See it? And there is one more time which is not here. But that type is called Pluta Swara. Pluta Swara. What is Pluta Swara? For example, you are running and all of a sudden you will fall down and you will get hurt. And immediately you want to call your mama. How do you call your mama? You'll scream for mama. Mama, mama, mommy. So that screaming thing and it gets extended. You will extend more. So that is Plutaswara. One more example. You want to call your friend. And your friend is walking somewhere. And he's running. And you are calling him and he's not running. And again you'll shout. Hey Rohan. So that thing is Plutaswara. Clear? Yes. So here, let's stand H, 
ഹ്രസ്വ സ്വര മോർ ടൈം ദീർഘസ്വര ആൻഡ് മോർ ടൈം സ്വര വെർ ദിസ് മോർ ടൈം ഇസ് യൂസ് ദിസ് ഇസ് യൂസ്ഡ് ഇൻ മൂവി ഡയലോഗ്സ് സോങ്സ് യെസ് വെരി ഗുഡ് നെക്സ്റ്റ് വിൽ കം ടു ദീസ് ടു If it is a one zero, it is called Anuswara, Anuswara and the two zeros is called Visarga, two zeros is called Visarga, very good. So notes will be given at the end of the recording, don't worry, you can copy down the notes and start practicing with the notes. Wonderful? Yes. If you have not understood, please repeat it once again and watch it once again. Okay. We'll go for the next section. We learned 15 letters. Next, we have to write and learn the 34 letters.